Hello, Mech Warriors. Welcome back to Opal Plays Mech Warrior 5. We're going to scoot over a little bit to uh, some other areas because we're, I think we're wearing out the stuff to where we were. Um, I went ahead and started down here on Murphid where you can find a juicy contract at level 12 for uh, Stop the Launch. And I just picked it because I knew the name and I found this targeted kill contract for 400. But it's the clan the wrong way, so I'm not taking it. I'm only going against clan, not for him. Why is that, you ask? Well, because that's how you get their salvage. They don't throw their sal your, your salvage unless you kill them on the, on the field. So let's see if this is still the thumpers, isn't it? <laughs> let's see if we draw the thumpers in, too. So this will be another 400 tonner, which are interesting as far as providing me more, um, yeah, it was a targeted kill, wasn't it? Yeah. It's a 96. It is indeed a 96. 400 ton. Wait a minute. That's not uh, against the clan. That's not against the clan. That's against the clan. So it's a scorched earth. Boy, I'm, I'm losing it. Let's uh, see what the payout looks like. I got nine, the standard nine, because Karita's still, I mean, still the same 109. It's not gone up. It's gotten better in a long time. 37 points might get me an assault mech in the 80 ton, 85 ton range. We'll see what I can do. Ooh. I don't like this payout. That means the thumpers are coming. Okie dokie. I mean, it means I get lots of money. I'll take that. Heads up, Commander. Weather conditions in the area will restrict visibility and have an effect on your sensors. I just gotta hope that this scorched earth is the same as the last mission in the last episode. Because it was a cakewalk. Now, was it a cakewalk because I also had mercenaries drop on me there? No, I didn't. I didn't have mercenaries on that one. You're supposed to weight that in, not just the payment that you get, but the difficulty of the rest of it. I read too many patch notes and Discord channels and crap like that. Get tired of watching YouTube all day. <laughs> Even fellow mech warriors blogging away. Vlogging away. I'm a Opa. I can get technical terms wrong. Not really, because I made my money in the tech industry. I should know the words. We have been ordered to destroy the forward operating base at the marked nav point. Prepare for a fight, Commander. But remember, the primary objective remains the destruction of the base itself. I'm preparing for mercenaries. Here they are. Unrecognized dropship closing in on your position. Uh, just get down here and do it. Here we go. Enemy transport touching down. I am prepared. Prepare yourself. Shot. 
Well, Kraken's got a dented fender. Good job, Commander. Those mercs will think twice before trying that again. Looks like you don't need evac anymore. See you when the mission's complete. Yes, you will. Toxic waste dumps. Wonder what the chances of surviving an ejection in this is going to be. Meanwhile, what's that map look like? Go up to the stunted tree, hang a left. Yep, got you. Okay, roll around the rim of the crater. Because there's no stunted tree. You see a dog with a red collar. Ask the owner for directions. you can't. You have one. Oh, he went the wrong way. I ran into a junk pile. It's the biggest risk of uh, this biome is your guys get hung up on a piece of terrain. And if I recall, yeah, we got to go up this way quite a bit more. That should get us there. Yeah, watch my guys peel off on a piece of debris. And wait for them to come through. Lots of stumble blocks like that one here. Same deal, get to the clear area and wait for them. It is far too easy to wind up going into combat with only one mech. Look at this guy. The Kraken. That should only have been the Kraken that moved. Oh, they're changing position. Time's up. I thought I saw an assault mark. I did not. Well, yeah, 
winged it. Yeah, here come some new targets. Got a lot of riflemen out there, huh? Other side of that uh, pile of garbage there. But I think I can run through it this way. Or over it. Should be a wee bit of an opening through here. Yeah, see, it's only important that I make it through. And there you have it. Nice 400 tonner. No uh, real opposition again, though. I think the uh, mercenaries threw heavier mechs at me than the clan did. So as a way of accumulating clan salvage, good missions. 600 points for that one. A little over halfway. Is that a Mad Dog Prime? Omni Mac. And 51. So, not going to be on the plate. That sucks. Nice to look at, but missed this one by one. And that was a headshot, so that would have been sweet to just put a couple bucks into and have ready. Looks like I'm about to get my shot at these guys again. Yeah, I'm not even thinking Banshees and Stalkers. So... Yes, yes, yes. No, not necessarily. Nice, I'm not a media, I'm not a Pulse guy. It's the duration of the shot. If I got a sweep to get on target, I just can't do it. 12 more points. I'll take some of these. Okay, I can take one of these. Then I better look for some ammo, huh? Yep, not gonna do a heat sink. I got four, that should do me, but King Crab Salvage, yeah, that's what I want. 
There's only one king crab in this entire game that I will ever take, and that would be the carapace, and that's only because I don't have any other hundred tenors. That would be my last choice. There, there are lower weapons on the arms. Just seem to hit the dirt too much. Um, it's a disadvantage. I don't like it. Look at those points. Yep, don't mind so much that I didn't get as many kills in. I'm telling him to go get the kills. That's his job. My, my job is to do the demolition. Okay, where the heck am I? How many missions have I already played in this episode? That doesn't matter if there's nothing nearby that I like. Then I go back to a uh, hub. Oh, that's too bad. This is the wrong side of the coin. I don't do defenses at 400 ton. That's silly. Well, it's just slow and ugly, what it is. Boy, nothing. Let's fly down and check out another area. I mean, what the heck? I'm back up in money wise a little bit. That'll do. I think once I get there, I'm going to do a repair, and I'm going to do a pause and look around the area. You don't need to see me doing that. Let's save you some time watching. That is the Hero Mech Highlander Heavy Metal, I bet. It's been in the market forever, or the Ravager, or whatever the other one is. Heavy Metal. I don't think I've ever seen an Atlas S. Yeah, introduction date 3050, that would be why. I don't usually play this far into it. I'm just, I'm in it for the clan. This is my first time ever playing for clan. Um, clan mechs, I should say. So what is this guy? An AC20, LRM, couple, yeah, streaks. Oh. Okay, so this is a standard clan, or standard, uh, Atlas with uh, double heat sinks. And what else has got going for it? That's it. I see nothing else on streaks instead. There used to be AC4s or something. Yeah, nothing special. Not for me. You want special? This guy's special. couple of larges, a scattering of SRMs that will sandpaper anybody down. Yeah, much better. The only thing that surprises me is I've never gone to the trouble of putting a uh, XL into it. Um, the increase in speed is surely because of the uh, War Dog upgrade for the Cantina missions. And I'm still looking for mobility gyros. I can't believe I haven't found them yet. Let's go ahead and repair him out and get out of here. Oh, oh, oh. Got to do that. And then do a repair all. Still waiting on this guy, which means the other guy is still going too. Let's take a look and see where we're at. Six more days. Okay. I'm going to pause briefly. You will not notice it too much. And he's back as if he never left. I never did take a good look at what the uh, equipment they had here. Oh, rare supercharger. Okay, we'll let that pass. Um, everybody's in repair. Seven days. That's what we're going to do. We're going to jump down here to Tall Seti just to let the strip the mech stripping finish out so I can get them out of my uh, active bay 
just in case my quarterlies come due. Let's see what's here. The one regret I've got in this uh, playthrough is I didn't really do the cantina missions like I normally do, which is very heavily. Um, and I did not because I did not want to be stuck chasing them around. I wanted to focus on what I was doing in preparations for the DLCs. Um, at this point, we got collecting a fire starter is a waste of my salvage max points. And so is even, a, well, I've got a Kentaro in Cold Bay, but... You get the picture. These are a waste of my uh, salvage money, points, cash, etc. So, not doing them. I got the one that means something to me, which is the war dog. Becomes useful to me in, in the extreme. So now we can go ahead and dump him back over. And the other one as well, which is down here by himself. Yes, he is. I'm saving these. I might, at some point, if I continue playing this through, go ahead and make these guys uh, into a lance. We'll see. We'll see. I also toyed doing a com completely Orion lance, um, and that would be fun as well. I've got my ON1P in the active bay. I had more, I sold one off, and I don't, yeah, I sold off a uh, Victor and a Karita, ON1V, ON1K. Okay, let's see. There we go, battlefield contract, 400 tons, anti-clan, and it's for the Karitas again. I was at 109 points, let's see what I'm at now. The old-fashioned way. Let's go there. It's because the new fashion way would be to look in my uh, stats under under factions and see where I stand. This game would be so much different at this point if I had not angered them, all of the, uh, yeah, all of the factions except for uh, Rasselhaig. I kept them happy because of the Free Rasselhaig Republic, the DLC 4, um, fighting for them. I made them all happy fighting the other folks. So, here we go. Contracts. What was that? That was a hundred, huh? Wow. This could be ugly. I don't know if I want to do... Yeah, I don't know if I want to do this one. Battlefield. War zone with extra spice. But not a battleground where you have a repair bay. Inordinate amount of money. Wolf's Dragoons are coming. I'm thinking real hard about that thumping I took a couple episodes ago. Whoops, not the cash. See, that's not enough shares to make it worthwhile, probably. It's probably going to be a net negative. We'll go find out. Yep. Yeah. It's got to load anyway. Gives me a chance for that adult beverage aiming fluid. Here we go.
We'll look at the bright side. At this point in the game, no, no that's going to be standard inner sphere. That's too bad. My thought was Wolf's Dragoons might have some good funky mechs, but they're going to have regular mechs. They're not going to. Commander, enemy forces will inevitably overrun this area, but we have been tasked with holding them back for as long as possible. We have substantial combat bonus opportunities the longer you can hold them off, but be sure not to overextend yourself. Let's see. If they're coming, they're going to come over here, I think. Yep. Where the hell are they? Oh, they're going to join up with all the other guys. That's ugly. What was that? They hit by one guy in the back, too. Dropship weaponry? That is an annihilator. Move. Well now. <coughs> Let's go take this battlefield out. Thank you. Nobody's severely damaged. Come on down. Okay, come on. As soon as they're in range, fair game. Probably just AC twos, but be Opa aim for the damn things, huh? Shooting SRMs like that's gonna help. It's a reflex action. No, I didn't get that. That just disappeared. Mm. Clever little guy, huh? I see the one behind me. Do not fall over the cliff, Opa. Moving on, lance target. Well, that was just bad reflexes, huh?
as his pieces fall down. I think heat jets are overrated at times. Hey, the board said actually fire some SRM or LRMs that time. Haven't seen them in a while. Halfway. Let's quit running around, take a breather. Some more aiming fluid. <coughs> that was silly. Give me that one. Uh oh, got one coming from behind too. Target A little adder. Other side of the rock. I'm going for this one on the other side of the rock just to make sure we don't lose track of it and have to scan the whole map just to find it again. Come on, little guy. I think there was over behind, one over behind these guys as well. Here, that one, or that one. Go get that one, guys. Gracias. Boar's head's taken a little bit of a hit here and there. I got a feeling the last set's going to be a doozy if these guys are lights. The reason Boar's Head takes a little bit of a beating is because it is so much faster than all the other mechs out here. So it gets shot at more because it shoots more. Oop. Yep. There's still a tank over here. There he is. Now I know I've got everything I should be getting except for that one little heavy right there. Whoop. I wonder. I oh, another savage wolf. We get him in salvage. I'll have four of them. That's right. I'm shooting legs. I wonder if the reason I'm not seeing assault mechs and such is the uh, combat loadout has been tempered by the fact that I've got uh, 
had to contend with mercenary mechs. Would hope not, but if so, that would suck because that means I'm going to start staying away from areas with mercenaries. What's over here? No, I can't see him. Dang it. We have another. Marauder 2C. Kill him. The Marauder script? It had to be a headshot. I didn't even see him shooting at it. Oh, I'm thinking Marauder for Yeah, uh, look. Yeah, I'm confused. I keep thinking Inner Sphere Marauder for whatever, 100 tonner. All I know for sure is they killed it. I don't feel like hanging out for the other sea bills to get it up to the 500 level for the uh, achievement. Unless they're right here and easy. Or I can rig it so they're coming to me. Nope. On the other hand, I'm 37 minutes in. I think we're going to go ahead and call this an episode once I get up and about and fix this up. I really want to see what's coming. I'm not, there we go. What we got? Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Nothing worth the salvage as far as I'm concerned. Of course, now it'll show me a dire wolf or something. Which is still the only 100 ton clan mech I've seen. I know they have others. Stone Rhino comes to mind. Hmm. I take that back. They have an Annihilator as well. Seen them, took one and salvaged and sold it. Couldn't make it into a decent mech. Almost made it. 150 points. Those remain good, uh, good payoffs. Hmm. Well, there's the Mad 2C. It's an 85 tonner. Got one floating around. I don't have the, the points for it. These are kick ass for money. It says I'd probably get about five in real life. Nothing but lights. I take these, I'll have one hell of a. Uh, support mech floating around, wouldn't I? What's the bump up out of that? Seven tons instead of eight tons. And for a tier four, six points? No, I don't know. Well, I'm going to have to start collecting these. I see no need for more than two of these. I really don't. Unless I get down to straight up 
nothing good, and then I'll come up and get them. Yeah, this is because I stripped a mech. Got four more out of it. Yep, just nothing. 17 Annihilator salvage? No, that's not a clan annihilator. That's straight up annihilator. And straight, same, 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 same. I got nothing, folks. I got nothing. 17. I'll take one of those. Then if I build a support mech, firing two, I'll have uh, one left over. I don't think I need more of this. I only got two, but they're only SRM2s anyway. I'm not going to burn half my points left. Heavy small laser. Half a ton, seven damage. How is that a bad thing? Holy crap, that's a knife fighter. Ugh, that bit. Three, oh, too bad. That looked nice, that really did. If I want to turn something else off. <coughs> I do, that. I mean, that's a half a ton, and oof, better than a battle fist, because I'm not fast enough to hit stuff with a battle fist. I'll take one of these. That'll do it. And then, because I want to get back to a industrial hub and see what the heck I've got that I can put together. Probably going to call it an episode, but and that will be next. When I come back out again. I barely got time for one more. Should I do it now? Now this mission's already 45 minutes in. We'll slide over. Folks, I interchange episode and mission quite often. Episode is video. Mission is combat mission. That's what I intend to use them for. Doesn't always work out that way. We are, we're back. I got no mechs down here. We got a slot empty still, so I'll do a repair all. Take a look around. Remind myself Devil's Rock next episode here on Opa Plays MechWarrior 5. Until then, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And uh, see you in the next episode, because until then, Opa is, in fact, out.